It was on the second night that one got a kind of second wind in sleep, an ability to perk up and enjoy oneself. Man against bird, with God for an umpire, they had set each other out this way for 3,000 years. I worship two gods. Yes, I do. <clears throat> Not just you alone. Mm -hmm. Have another go. Well, you may be tired, but you haven't lost your appetite, have you? think I sound drunk? Well, I'm not, Goss. I'm tired. But I'm going to... going to... have a drink. Before I've finished it, you're going to be asleep. Ten days or a fortnight, unless in a shorter time I find her a found hawk. Which I shall the sooner understand because I see a... Oh, God. Goss finally gave in at the end of the third day. The conquest was a visible one. We had waited 72 hours for this moment. The moment at which the hawk, coerced by no cruelty of mine, but only by the desire for sleep, could first say with confidence, I am so sleepy that I will trust this perch to sleep on, even though you stroke me, even though you have no wings and a beak of pliable bristle. Thank you. 